At first glance, this picture may not seem particularly exciting. But zoom in a little and you'll spot a handfish. It's a really exciting find because this is only the third time that we've seen this particular species. Scientists believe it's a narrow body handfish, which hasn't been seen since 1996. And just going on its depth and its, its location that we think possibly it is a narrow body handfish. The happy discovery of the handfish was made during a month-long CSIRO voyage in July. The scientists were repeating a survey of Australia's southeastern waters from 25 years ago to see what's changed. There are certainly a lot more jack mackerel and a lot more blue mackerel. That suggests that the ocean conditions and the habitat conditions for those species has changed to be, to be favourable. The marine waters of southeastern Australia are warming four times faster than the global average. As the marine environment rapidly changes, anecdotal evidence suggests species distributions are also shifting, while commercial and recreational fishers say they're not catching what they used to. Now we're seeing um, things like uh, snapper a little bit more around Tassie, which, uh, you know, if you go back 20 or 30 years, you, you're unheard of. Mr Muir says his commercial fishery, which fishes at depths of around 500 metres, is not yet seeing much variation. But recreational fishers are catching what different species. The problem is it's, it's actually bad news, you know, it's just a, a sign of things that are changing. We have to understand for, from an environmental perspective why that's occurring, whether it's management or whether it's something that out of our control like climate. The scientists hope to have initial results by Christmas. Lucy MacDonald, ABC News.